welcome to our special show, Let's Talk Infertility. I'm Priyanshi Sharma. In our previous show, we spoke extensively about the lack of awareness on what causes infertility and the stigma around open conversations about the silent struggle that couples or individuals face on their road to parenthood. That is the open conversation that we are bringing to you as part of this campaign, Let's Talk Infertility. Dr. Luca, as we understand, unlike other fields of medicine, reproductive medicine is still at a very young and emerging subspeciality. Now, being less than 50 years old, of course. Now, in this context, how important is the role of research? Do you think that institutions who are heavily invested in it have a natural advantage over doctors who are running individual practices? Definitely, yes. Not only because uh, infertility and reproductive medicine is a young branch of medicine, but also because it's extremely complex. We should never forget that we are treating, uh, uh, we try to treat a disorder of a couple, but in fact, there are two individuals. I would prefer to say that infertility itself is not just a disease, but being fertile is a symptom. So let me make it clear. If you have fever, you can have fever for many, many reasons. And you need to know where the problem comes from. So first of all, investigation, and it has been said pre uh, previously by Dr. Fatemi, personalizing the treatment requires a lot of research, not only from the clinical point of view, but also from the laboratory's point of view. So making research is a team effort and is also multidisciplinary work. So only large organizations under uh, the control and the, coordinator, the coordination of uh, very experienced embryologists and clinicians can really lead to do research that are uh, the most influential in our clinical practice. Um, it's interesting to say that uh, when you involve and you explain to patients why they should participate to research, they not only understand very well, but they are very happy to do so. One of our logos, just to give you an idea, has been written from uh, uh, one of our patients, and it says, where, where research is done, more babies are born. And they think this is the truth.